on another video. Today we are going to be finding out the truth about the waterproof rustler. Um, I think it's 100% waterproof. Uh, some people may say otherwise. Uh, today I'm going to be finding out for myself and I'm going to bring you guys along. Enjoy today's video and please give it a big thumbs up. And please remember that I am actually not running the stock uh, VXL5 system, uh, the brush system, brushless system. I'm not running any of that by Traxxas. I am running the uh, the Castle 3800 KB. So uh, I guess we'll be testing to see if that's waterproof too. I was also going to show you guys that uh, I am also running a Zippy 5200 uh, milliamp LiPo 2 cell battery and so we'll be seeing if that's waterproof too. Hey guys, what's up? I switched over to my GoPro and this is how I'm going to be filming today's video. Uh, it just went completely submerged. You guys saw that. It is literally 100% underwater. I already knocked it off into the water. Now I got to go in and get it. Lay my controller down. Definitely gonna put my wallet and my phone. I'm going in for it. That's crazy. I didn't mean to. The side of that already. I was going to later in the video, not right now. I guess let's throw it up there and see if she still works. Look at that, she still works. I would say so far it's uh, pretty waterproof. Alright, let's get it more wet. Man, it's just pushing right through this water. Look at the waves taking it. Or the current. Right through it. Makes it through no problem. It's crazy how these things come 100% waterproof. I mean, look at this. I have, I'm putting this thing, pushing this thing to its limits, getting it wet, and uh, she's still going. See how far across water we can skid, if we can skid at all. Do you guys think that I will make it from there all the way over to the other side? Do you guys think I will hit the water and just stop? Leave your comments down below right now. All right, hopefully you left your comment. Now let's test it. Ah, well. If you guys said it's just gonna plump right to the bottom, then you're right. I'm gonna try it again though, I'm never gonna give up. I wanna make this hydroplane. I just don't think it's it's gonna hydroplane without paddle tires. If you guys want me to buy paddle tires and hydroplane, give me a big thumbs up on this video right now.
I'll take it right now. It's submerged in the water again. And I'm still driving it. While it's submerged in water, it's slowly creeping through. Play with the neighbors. Howdy, how are you guys? Look at the balloon on those. Now let's put it in the water, full speed, see what it does. Yeah, it just, uh, just soaked me, guys. It just soaked me. Let's see if I can put it out here where it's a little bit shallow, or not so deep, where there's water not really flowing. And let's see if I can get it to crawl along the bottom of the creek bed. Still up to about my knees. Let's completely submerge it in water. And uh, I'm gonna put you guys underwater and see if you guys can see this crawl underwater. Guys, um, I'm pulling the trigger right now. And I just said, let's get it get it underneath, see if it's fully waterproof. And uh, it's not going anywhere right now. So let's pull it out of the water. Let's figure out what's wrong with it. Oh, just kidding. Pulled it out of the water. And now it's working. So let's put it back in the water and try this again. I don't know why it wasn't working. Yeah, when I put it underneath water, when I put it underneath the water, um, it's not working, but when I pull it out now, it does. So I'm not sure uh, what that's about. Let's get it back up on dry land and do a little more bashing before I have to end this video. died after I just did a couple uh, I kind of slid sideways did a little bit of a burnout now nothing so let's figure out what's wrong with it again all right so I think something's starting to get a little uh, a little wet I'm not sure what it is but now uh, every time it gets in any sort of water it just completely shuts off I have no control over it so uh, that's gonna be the end of today's video I would say it is a hundred percent waterproof um, you guys saw I, I sunk it off the waterfall I uh, took it out over there it was down to my knees so probably three foot deep over there um, it was cruising along just fine until after about five uh, consecutive minutes being in the water um, now I'm just gonna go let it dry I'm gonna take it apart clean everything and uh, set it back on the shelf until next video thank you guys very much for watching um, if you haven't already, please give the video a big thumbs up. Uh, if you like these GoPro videos, please give this video a big thumbs up. Um, and I would say, I don't know, leave your guys' comments down below what you guys think. Is the Traxxas Rustler 100% waterproof or not? Or is it even waterproof or not? I would say it is. Thank you guys for joining me on today's video. I'll see you guys next time.